concrete industry is focused on reducing its emissions, with the aim to produce net zero concrete by 2050. Ready-mixed concrete is the most utilized construction material in the world, contributing to a wide array of projects from a city's largest high-rise towers and bridges to residential curbs and sidewalks. Throughout a busy delivery schedule, a concrete truck regularly travels from the manufacturing site to many different job sites, making it a common site in the local community. Questions from the public often arise from a lack of understanding about the work being performed or the environmental protection measures that may be in place. One of the most common activities a member of the public is likely to observe during a concrete truck's time in the local community includes truck washout. Concrete trucks require access to water for various purposes, including washing out the drum and chute after a pour to avoid the buildup and hardening of concrete. To minimize water consumption, industry professionals are adopting best practices such as using high-pressure hoses or sprayers to ensure effective cleaning of the drum and chute. To prevent runoff, most trucks utilize a bucket system at the end of the chute. This system catches and contains any remaining concrete and wash water, which allows it to be disposed of properly. This control measure prevents water from entering storm drains or nearby water bodies, thereby minimizing the risk of pollution and protecting aquatic ecosystems. To demonstrate how these systems operate, we recently visited a representative from Lafarge, Canada in the Lower Mainland to learn more. So Lafarge has a policy of 100% no slurry or concrete on the ground. We use this environment system to enable that not to happen. Okay, so now we're going to use the EnviroGuard, turn that on, and we're sucking up the water, the dirty water. Okay, now you can see this filter in the EnviroGuard. This filter filters out all the large aggregate, so what gets sucked up is your cementitious and sand and maybe small bird's eye. And that's it. Pump on. Okay, so now everything in the pocket, going through the filter, going into the hose, through the pump, you follow the blue hose, into the hopper, into the drum. Nothing is getting on the ground, and it works really well. All that's gonna be left in here is rocking a bit of bird's eye. There you go, no more cement, it's just, just water. Just tap water, that's it. I know there's no more cement in there, nothing's coming out. I rinse out my hose through the pump. Make sure the pump's clean. And now I see clean water coming out. Okay. And even here at the pump, it's just water, tap water coming out. As you can see, there's nothing on the ground. Thank you for watching this video today. By implementing best practices such as truck washout and bucket collection, the concrete industry is striving to minimize its impact on the environment and protect our natural resources. Thanks for watching.